Don't you love not uploading in weeks and then when you finally make a video it gets striked up the ass and now your video can't be viewed by anyone? Honestly, I love YouTube. They have so many cool features but this is by far my favorite one. But in all seriousness, I know it's not YouTube's fault, it's the con dumpster companies like Marvelous Entertainment that have bots that automatically strike your video. And I never really had a problem with copywriting videos but I'm sure it's frustrating when YouTube is your job but personally I thought as long as the video is still up I could care less. But I never dealt with having my video not be able to be viewed by anyone up until now. And I'm not gonna lie boys, it's pretty fucking annoying especially when you're trying to keep a schedule. I recently uploaded a video praising anime music and the company behind Tokyo Ghoul strike my video after I said Unravel is a holy grail of anime openings. And that is why Parasite is the better show, you fucking assholes. But the most annoying thing about this all is that, and not to sound racist, but every Japanese company copy strikes videos. But at least Nintendo takes your money and doesn't take your whole fucking video down. And it sucks because Japanese people are way better than Americans at pretty much everything and they're missing out on so much free exposure. It's fucking annoying how out of the loop some of these companies are. And honestly, shout out to all the anime YouTubers, I don't know how you avoid getting striked. I I looked it up and it's I wasted so much time. I ended up watching assholes making 10 minute videos giving me useless information or sometimes I'll like stumble upon a Hank Green video from like 2010 with rules that aren't even relevant anymore. I honestly get so upset when companies shit on smaller creators. I get it's your content, but we aren't stealing it. We're using it to prove a point or to worship your content. There are so many examples of companies doing this shit, like Nintendo with the whole GBA ROM hack situation where they allowed people to download old Game Boy games, mostly old Pokemon games, onto their phone. And I get why they took it down even though they weren't making money off of the Game Boys anymore. And them taking it down did nothing but show how greedy Nintendo is. And the same shit with Blizzard when they took down the vanilla World of Warcraft server. Which again, they weren't making money off of that at the time. And I know now they're relaunching those servers probably because they're losing so much money because everyone hates current World of Warcraft. But there was such a big gap from the announcement of Vanilla World of Warcraft, they could have at least shut the other one down a couple days before they announced their own Vanilla World of Warcraft. But instead they ended up looking like money hungry assholes like Nintendo. Uh, if, the, if the server is making a profit, then uh, I think it's fair to say that that I can see them taking down something like that. But a lot of these are just for the love of the old game. Like this one, Nostalrius, that Blizzard just shut down. Why Blizzard? No shit, people are gonna try to put up your old game. They're doing it for free out of love. These people literally on their website say, for over a year, you have been part of an extraordinary journey. A journey back to the early days of our beloved game. Wow, they really seem like a bunch of profiteers, don't they? A journey in which hundreds of thousands of people took part in together. Something we'd never seen before on retail or private. We built a strong community sharing values and a common genuine interest for this wonderful game created by Blizzard. Blizzard, I don't know, I can kind of see why you hate these guys, why you sent them a literal, actual, formal notice of we're gonna fucking sue you. Uh, have you ever thought about adding servers for previous expansions as they were then? No. And, and by the way, you don't want to, that, to do that either. You think you do, but you don't. Overall, these companies I talked about have the right to do whatever the fuck they want with their content, but that doesn't give you a pass to be a greedy asshole and strike down videos or take down fan servers trying to play what isn't available anymore. And I'm all for copyright when you're in the wrong, but if you're using a little clip to prove a point or to add context, then I believe it's fair use. And it sucks because lately it feels like most creators don't even know what's fair use and what isn't. I filed a dispute for the content I used defending myself with fair use, but the sad truth is you're probably never going to see that video, which I took days on making, praising something I love. Marvelous Entertainment is known for copy striking videos and not lifting the strike so who knows maybe i'll upload it like on pornhub or something but honestly i lost a lot of respect for marvelous entertainment everyone thinks that your unfair rules are pushing your content off youtube and other major social media platforms everyone thinks you're a joke of a fucking company and the only reason why people know your name is because you keep striking videos down i love tokyo ghoul but i'll probably never talk about it on this channel again because i can't use clips to show or prove my point at the end of the day i have no problems with the show that marvelous entertainment have produced the problem i have is with marvelous entertainment itself not the creator of Tokyo Ghoul or Funimation. I just don't see what you gain from blocking my video worldwide. I knew uploading the video it was gonna get claimed meaning I wouldn't get ad money for the video, which is fine I don't even have ads on my channel anyway. But this is just unnecessary. Blocking videos worldwide for a clip of an audio or visuals? Go fuck yourself. Whatever, I'm done with this video. Fuck Marvelous Entertainment and fuck season 2 of Tokyo Ghoul. That shit was an embarrassment to Japanese animation and the perfect example of how to ruin your show.